Hey guys, Soccer from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to transfer files from your Samsung Galaxy smartphone that I have right over here to your Windows PC or your Windows laptop, or vice versa, from your Windows laptop or your PC into your phone. All this is going to be done officially. It's going to be free and it's going to be fast. As an example, here is a folder right over here. I just sent over four, uh, two video files. This one and this one and two photos from the phone to the Windows PC wirelessly, instantaneously. Let's get started. All right, so the very first thing that you want to do is you want to download an application to your Samsung Galaxy smartphone. And then you are going to download the same application to your Windows computer, whether that's a PC or a laptop, does not matter. And again, this is all going to be free software the software is by Samsung, so it is 100% official, and it's free, and there's no ads. All right, so first, let's download the application on the smartphone. So to download the application, what you want to do is you want to click the link down below. That's going to take you to my website. Once you're at the website, all you want to do is scroll down just a little bit, and it's going to be under download. It's going to be link number one. You click the link. It'll take you to the Galaxy Store. And this is the application we need, Samsung Flow for Galaxy. It's made by Samsung, and you simply want to install this. Now, if you click this link and it doesn't work, I also left a link down here uh, for the Play Store. If this does not work, you can download it via the Play Store. You click this guy. It will take you to the Play Store from where you can download the same exact application if the first option does not work. Now, once you download the application, all you want to do is you want to launch it on this phone. So I'm, I'm just going to launch this. I'm going to leave it right here. The next step is to move over to our Windows PC or laptop and download the same application. All right, so on your Windows laptop, all you want to do is you want to go to the Microsoft Store. So at the bottom left, simply type in uh, Store, and that's going to bring up the Microsoft Store in the top. You click on it. And then all you want to do is you want to search for Samsung Flow application. All right. So once you search for that, it's going to pop right up. It's going to be this one right here with the blue icon. You click on it and that's going to be Samsung Flow. And all you are going to do is click the button here that says get or install. And you can see it is from Samsung Electronics. And that's all you need to do as far as downloading the application is concerned. Now we are ready to transfer files back and forth. Now, once you have installed the application, all you want to do is simply launch it and you are going to see this screen right here. All right. So once all that is set up, you can see that application is right there. And over here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to launch the Samsung Flow application. Now, once you launch this for the first time on your phone, it says, start the Samsung Flow setup on your computer or your tablet. So that's going to be right here. So let me just zoom into that real quick. And all you want to do is you want to click start right over here. Once you click the start, uh, you want to make sure that your computer and your phone are on the same Wi-Fi network. That's it. It doesn't have to be the same Bluetooth. It just has to be the same Wi-Fi network. You can do Bluetooth as well if you want. But your phone is going to show up right here. That's my 21 Ultra. That's right over here. It's popping up right here. And all you want to do is you want to click Saki 21 Ultra. And it's going to say register the device. It says confirm passkey to connect with Saki S21 Ultra. I am seeing the same passkey here. All this is happening, happening wirelessly. I'm going to click OK at the bottom. And over here, I'm going to do the same thing. I am going to click OK. Uh, once you do that, it says setup complete. That's how easy the setup process is. So now you are going to see this screen and this screen. And that's exactly what you want to see. Now I'm going to show you, since we're all ready, how to actually transfer files back and forth. Now, one more thing you want to make sure you set up properly is before we move on further, once you are at this step and you see this exact window here, you do want to tap on this icon here. You do want to tap on settings and you do want to uh, choose a downloads folder. So 
when a file does come into your PC from your phone, it will go into that, that particular folder. So in my case, I have a folder here that says incoming right here on the top. That's a folder on my desktop. That's where all the files transferred from my phone to my Windows will go. So simply click change here and pick the proper uh, folder that you want to use. No matter where that is, it's gonna be up to you. All right, so everything is now set up. What I'm gonna first show you guys is how to transfer a file uh, from the phone to the Windows. Okay, so let's do that right now. So let me just zoom in over here. So the first thing you wanna do to get the process started is you wanna click this plus button here. Once you click that, it's gonna give you the option uh, to choose from images, video files, or my files. So let's uh, do a video file as an example, because it's a large file, so I want you to see uh, how quickly it transfers over. So I'm gonna tap on the video file. All my video files are popping up right here. Let me go into my car videos here. Let's just pick two of these guys. One, two, okay? And that's it. Now you're gonna click on done. And look at that, it starts at the process right here. And the same thing is reflecting right here, okay? So those two video files are now being transferred onto my Windows and it's logging everything properly. And then there's my incoming folder right there. All these files got transferred over to that folder because that's how I set it up uh, from this area right here as I showed you guys uh, earlier. Now, if I click on this one right here, those video files, let me just grab that window, are in here as you can see. Alrighty, and a, a photo that I sent earlier. And that's the same thing that you have here. The good news is you can actually click this and that's gonna start the video. You can actually click this and that's gonna start the video. Now, one more thing, let's do a photo. So I'm gonna tap on plus, tap on image. Let's go into the cars folder here. Let's just pick this one here, click on done. Same thing, okay? It just popped up, that was very fast. But if I launch my incoming folder, it is gonna be that photo is right here, as you can see, which is fantastic, okay? That's an amazing way to transfer files uh, from the phone to the Windows PC. And if you wanna do from the Windows PC into the actual phone, it's the same exact process. At the bottom, you click on plus, and then you can navigate into any folder that you want. Here's just one example. I'm gonna choose this photo and look at that. Same thing, 98%, boom, it transferred over. Now this phone, I can click on this and it's gonna launch that uh, photo that I shared over uh, from my Windows PC. And that's it guys. I mean, that's how simple it is using the Samsung Flow application, completely free, no ads, very efficient and fast. Uh, you wanna download the application on your phone, on your Windows, and then boom, back and forth, back and forth, all right, all day. And I will show you one more thing. Let me just zoom in over here. Uh, on this application, you can also go over to notifications to see all the notifications that are popping up on your phone's notification panel are also gonna show up right here in case you wanna see what's happening, okay? Just so you know. And you also have a clipboard. So if you copy something on your phone, okay, you can actually paste it over here using this clipboard. And then you have a bunch of settings here. You can go direct to your incoming files, your settings, or scan for any other Samsung phones that you have. Uh, but that's the flow history, flowing of data in and out. And this is notifications. Look over here. Uh, this portion here is flow uh, in coming from the phone and the blue portion here is going out to the phone. It's like a little chat window. So that's absolutely fantastic. If you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.